Good afternoon everyone, my name is Richard Abrahams, I run a company called TLC International Development and we're all about inspiring people to take action and over the next 20 minutes I hope I can inspire you to become authors. Now if you want to make the best business decision that you've ever made and you've just got a £20 note to make it, it's about becoming an author. Now let me take you on a little story, about 20 years ago I used to do a lot of the outward bound kind of activities. I was an archery instructor, rifle shooting, did a lot of kayaking and a lot of team building. And during that time, um, I wrote a book around about a thousand different games, but well, not one that I got published, but I went to publishers. And I tried as hard as I could to get this book published. And they all said they'll take a hundred games here, a hundred games there, but no one would take the whole lot. Uh, and I just gave up on it and they still sit on the bottom shelf. And let's fast forward now 20 years to last year when I set up TLC International Development. And I said to, I was talking to some different people about what are some things I need to do. And they said, on your website, you need something that will really draw people's attention. And when you looked around a lot of the websites, everyone had an ebook. So I thought, okay, I'll write an ebook. And so I downloaded a few, worked out how many numbers, you know, how many words go into an ebook. And I found out there was about 5,000 words in an ebook. So I thought, okay, who's my target audience? It was people very much like you, single business owners, uh, small businesses. And what was the biggest challenge most of us have? That's around our time. So I thought, okay, I can write a book on time management, uh, and, and, and e an ebook that I'll give out to everyone. And that's what I set out to do. And this is the actual ebook an A4 Word document with just some writing in there. And I got on and I started writing this ebook, but I got a bit carried away. And the first time I looked at the word count, I was up to about 12,000 words. <laughs> and I thought, I still got a lot more book, you know, a lot more tips that I could actually put into this book. So I thought I'll carry on writing and maybe what I'll do is I'll spread it over two or three different ebooks. And then I heard about self-publishing. And self publish and I remember back to the days where I tried to publish that first book and it really didn't happen for me and I kind of thought, do I really want to go down this route? But I looked into self-publishing and particularly through Amazon and Amazon have a site called createspace.com and I signed up for it, it's a free site to sign up to and basically you can upload your own book to this Amazon site, upload a cover and they turn it into a book for you, just like this. And it really is that simple. And that's what I want to try and get across to you. So some of the stages that you'll go through is it will ask you for your name. I think we can all get past that stage, right? And it'll say, what's the title of your book? But don't worry right at this stage, what's the title? Just get an idea. And maybe at the end, if you've got a title for a book that you can put out there, we'll share a few different titles. But you start thinking about, okay, I'm going to put this book out there. And on the site, it just says, write a little brief description about it and you can change all this information so it really is that easy it says what size book do you want well I chose an 8x5 some people choose 9x6s it really is a case of just choosing the size of your book but do you want it shiny or flat and it literally is just a click and so I uploaded my word document basically took this ebook that was a lot more words in it now shrunk the margins down to 8x5 uploaded the book to Amazon and what they do is in within about 24 hours they give you a digital version now this is where you start getting really excited because all of a sudden your book and your cover is up there digitally you can spin it around you can flick through the pages and you get this real excitement that this is actually going to turn out to be a physical book now remember at this stage I've still spent zero pounds I've only, it's only taken me from the start process to this process now, six weeks. Uh, and that wasn't putting in a lot of time, just about an hour a day just writing the book. But you start spinning it, it actually highlights if there's some errors in there. Now they don't read it for you and spell check it, that's what you've got your best friends for. But it did highlight that I had a few pictures in here that they said it wasn't, you know, 300 DPI, but you know, they work out perfectly fine. Um, but it will highlight a few things that it might need to, to, for you to improve and all you do is you re-upload the, the, the actual content and then you get this digital version. When you're happy with that, 
they recommend that you order a proof copy. Now, I decided that I, I wanted to have three, just because I thought if we're going to have one, I might as well have three. And this was the first time I spent any money, right? And it cost me £20 to get the book shipped to my address. And the day that I opened up this book, or the three books, the only way that I can give you a... Anyone in here got children? You know when they first come out? <laughs> It was just like that. And if anyone here uh, has written a book, you'll know that, it, you know that experience, that when you open it up, you get this book. And it really is that simple. We've heard some fantastic stories today. You know, the cocktails, all I can remember was about the rum, right, and, and the, the quantity. But if it was all in a book, you know what I mean there, Steve. Yeah, been, Steve's been talking about writing a book for ages. But it really is that simple. Now, some of you think, okay, well, maybe I'm not that good at English. I failed as well. All right, so what you can do is you get your best friends to write it. And my friend, Rob, did an amazing job and gave me a D minus. It was a, he, he printed it all off. He highlighted absolutely everything in red. Uh, but he actually went through it and he read it. And I got three or four other people to read it. And then it was actually out there. So we're, the book is now out there, and this was just a real learning curve for me because I didn't know where this was going. At the time, it was just a case of writing an e-book. And then all of a sudden, I've got this book, and what do I do now? And so fast forwarding now, here's what the next plans are. My book has got 30 tips in it about time management. And so what I'm going to be doing is looking for 30 people. So those of you out there watching this TV show, <laughs> right, 30 people to record the audio version of my book. And that will be taking one of the tips and actually using that to, to have a conversation. And I'm going to do a DVD version of it as well. And I'm going to write 11 more books. I'm going to have 12 books in the series. But it's just the power. It's not so much the book. It's not people say, how many have you sold on Amazon? It's not about that. It's about the connections that I have with people. Let's give you another idea how the book can be really beneficial for you. Is I got a call from one of my clients. They're out in Canada. They work for an oil and gas company, and I do some coaching with them. And they've got their top 15 clients coming for a dinner. Uh, and if you know anything about the oil and gas industry at the moment, it's a little bit down at the moment. So they want to put on something a little bit special and show how they can be really beneficial. And they're going to come up with this survival package. And they've asked me if they can put a copy of my book inside the survival package. Well, I'm thinking, yeah. I mean, this is the top 15, you know, executives in the oil and gas industry out in Canada. That's the power that your book can actually have for you. You can do uh, audios with it, DVDs with it, whatever you want. Now, for some of you, you're going to think, OK, where do I start? So let's make it really simple. If you were to take a little index card and write on that index card the chapter title, and again, don't worry too much if you've got it exactly right at this stage, because you'll make some changes. But write the chapter title on one side, flip the card over, and on the other side, write three to five subheadings, bullet points, about that chapter. Now, how many of you have driven for more than 10 minutes to get here? <laughs> right? Three hours for me, right? In that three hours, I, I was doing something on the way here, but on the way back, I'm going to be recording part of my next book. I'm just going to be talking to my phone. Um, so if any of you see me walking, <laughs> driving down the motorway, that's what I'm doing is I'm writing my next book. But I'll be talking to my phone and just summarising those points. It doesn't have to be 100% at this stage, but what you can then do is you send it off to one of these agencies, Fiverr or Elance or, or something else, and they'll transcribe it. One of the guys that I was helping out, he actually um, got, I think it was about 26, 28,000 words transcribed. For £28. Right? So if you think this is going to cost you a lot of money to become an author of a book, it's not. 20 quid gets you the book, it gets it on Amazon. Now, up on Amazon you can choose your own pricing. I went for £7.77. I like the number 7. <laughs> <laughs> and it said you want it in uh, American money or English, so I fixed it in, in English, of course. But, you, you know, with all of this, there's a, it's the power of the book and how you use it for, you know, afterwards. And if I can emphasize anything to you, this is the best credibility tool that you will ever have in your business. It helps grow your business. It takes you places. You've all told some amazing stories, Dee, great story. 
get it on paper, you get it in a book, it, you know, it really can help you. I, Steve gave me a call about two or three months ago, he said, I've got one of my guys, he needs a bit of a kick up the, the backside, uh, could you have a chat with him, he wants to write a book. Kevin Holland? Holland, yeah, Kevin Holland. So I, I picked up the phone and gave Kevin a call on the Tuesday. We had a chat on the Tuesday, the following Tuesday, he's standing with a picture of him holding his book, that's how quick you can do it. Uh, I was coaching another guy who was doing a talk at an exhibition, and I said, you've got to have a book. We're six weeks away from the exhibition. Uh, I said, you've got to have a book because it's going to be really powerful for you. He listened. We wrote a book. He said I gave him a bit of a headache because I was always challenging him for the next chapter. But he wrote this book. We had it delivered within five weeks. We took 100 copies to this exhibition. He did his 30-minute talk. And at the end of that talk, he just put up a little slide about the book. And he said, I am this week the author of this new book uh, and if anyone would like a copy please come to my stand and I'll give you know and, and please buy a copy in the time it took him to take his microphone off to chat to a couple of people uh, around the exhibition area I was with him we walked back to the stand there's a queue of 30 people and out of those 30 people he sold 30 books I sold 27 copies of my book as well which we <laughs> happen to have there so it was great in that respect but more importantly those 57 odd books that we that we sold led to deeper conversations with people so you're thinking okay so he said it's only going to cost me 20 quid to get my first proof copies and get it up on amazon i might want it up on kindle so just push the button that says put it on kindle <laughs> it's that easy <laughs> right um now just to give you an idea of cost um you, there's basically two prices and each each book is different depending on the thickness um but for this particular book here so 190 something odd pages. Um, it was about, I, it cost between about £2.48 and £3.50 to get them delivered to my door. The difference is how quick you want them delivered. If you want them delivered in a week, it's, a, it's about £2.48. Uh, sorry, £3.48. If you want it delivered in about 30 days, it's, it's, a, it's a little bit cheaper. You actually wrap it up in a nice bit of paper, nice bit of tissue. Um, make it look really impressive, stick a stamp on it, post it out to the person that you've met that day so they get it the next day. You, if you want, you can stick a little golden tick in it, in it like I do, which offers free coaching sessions, so you just stick that in, inside. <laughs> um, but it leaves a lasting impression, and it makes it... It just stands you out from the crowd. If you think of all the great people out there, some of them have written one or two books, three books, and, and everything else. But everyone that you know that's done really well in their business, most of them have got a book. So if I can urge you to do anything else, is think about how easy it is. When you're driving home, you can get most of it written today. Get a book published. It'll be the best business decision. It'll cost you 20 quid initially, and that's it. And that will lead you to have the kind of exposure that I've had. Hey, I'm standing here on TV talking about my book, really. I mean, I'm telling you how to do a book, but my book's actually there. So go out and do it. Don't wait, Steve. Make it happen, right? And get out and do it. Thank you very much, everyone. Smile, be chat, join for networking.